Hi friends, hope you're well. This is Atif and you're watching Moon333 and welcome to the new update on Bitcoin Cash. The information I'm providing here in this video is for educational purpose only. This is not intended to be investment advice. So please seek a duly licensed professional for investment advice and do your own research as well. Uh, guys, this is my previous article and I've also posted a video on this article. And here in this article, uh, I just told you that the price action will hit the key level resistance of $501. At that time, the price uh, price of Bitcoin Cash was $378. And I'm just playing this idea. I just published on 2nd Feb 2020. And we can see that the price action went very close to the $501. It went up to $497.53. So it was rejected by the, by the key level resistance and the rejection was so much powerful as we can see that the price action even broke down the previous support of $355 and moved to the next support of $300 and four dollars after being rejected by this key level resistance of the 501 dollars the power of the rejection shows that this is really a key level resistance therefore the price action went to the first resistance level at 304 dollars which i have shown in my previous video here we have a strong support of 100 simple moving average and this support of the price action so the price line started consolidated here and after being consolidated the price action is now moving up towards the next resistance level again and to try or make an attempt to break out this resistance of $355 all right if we place uh, here I have placed uh, the Fibonacci retracement tool now we can see that the price line is retraced up to golden ratio that is 0.618 Fibonacci level that is golden ratio and ideal for the traders that the price action should retrace up to this level and after when the price action uh, gets retraced up to this level it should move up from here and we can see that at this time the price line is likely to moving up but so far we have only two green candlesticks. We cannot say anything more about that, uh, that the price action will move up to, uh, up to the next resistance level or not so far, but it, it is likely to move up from this golden ratio. But we have hope cause uh, here we also have a 100 simple moving average below this golden ratio that is also providing a very strong support. And after that, we have a 200 simple moving average that is more stronger support than the 100 SMA. And that is also providing the support to the Bitcoin Cash. And if we see the order of the moving averages, then uh, the alligator mouth is still open. We can see that the 25 simple moving average is above all moving averages. Then the 50 moving average is after 25 moving average and above 100 and 200 simple moving averages. Then 100 simple moving average and the 200 simple moving average is below all the moving averages so this is very ideal situation so far only this 25 simple moving average has shown the tendency to form a bear cross or death cross with the with the 50 moving average but uh, this death cross cannot uh, produce that pressure that the price action will break down the support of 100 simple moving average or 304 dollar support with uh, with this golden ratio of 0.618 Fibonacci level. Uh, so, and if we see uh, the, the indicators and the oscillators on daily chart, then indicators and oscillator, oscillators are also turning bullish. We can see that after hitting at the Bollinger Band support, the price action is uh, showing the tendency to move up. The RSI went in the oversold zone up to uh, up to uh, 29.93 level 
And after that, we can also see the stochastic also has given us the bull cross from the, for, from the oversold zone. And now the MACD is also turning bullish. At this time, it is turned weak bearish, but soon it will be turned bullish, we can see. And if we see the EMAs or exponential moving averages, then we can see that uh, since January 5, 2020 up to uh, February 16, 2020, the price action was moving above the EMA 10 and 20. And here the price action also used this EMA as a support and took the bounce from this EMA 10. And uh, when the price line was having a correction rally, I was expecting that it will again use this EMA 10 or 20 as a support and move up. But uh, the price action crossed down, unfortunately, completely these uh, both EMAs and now it is moving sideways. But uh, so far we can we have seen that uh, the indicators and the oscillators up to day charts are turning bullish. Once these oscillators and indicators will be turned bullish or reflected up to two day chart, then we can see that even they have reflected almost, we can see that a MACD's turn weak bearish and stochastic did not give the bull cross, but soon it will be uh, it will give the bull cross. Then we can see that the price line will again move up uh, uh, the, the cross of these EMAs or EMA 10 or 20. As soon as the Bitcoin Cash will cross these EMAs up, as soon uh, the Bitcoin Cash will be back in the bullish rally, which was started uh, since December up to February 2020. And this is the most powerful bullish signal for me because I love the harmonic patterns and uh, I, whenever I find them, I, I, I love to trade them. And here on daily chart, on two day chart, uh, the price action of Bitcoin Cash has formed a bullish cipher pattern. If we see the formation or dimensions, then di uh, dimensions of this pattern is uh, driven so much perfectly. Uh, this is the initial leg and after initial leg, the A to B leg is retraced up to uh, between 0.382 up to 0.618 Fibonacci. And after that, we can see the reflection or projection uh, of the price action up to uh, between 1.27 uh, up to 1.414 Fibonacci projection of X, uh, A to X leg. This is the projection of X to A leg. And uh, the final leg is retraced up to uh, between the area of 6.618 up to 0.786 Fibonacci. This is the projection of uh, C to X to C leg. So uh, now the price action after hitting the spike in this potential reversal zone is moving up. So this is a very good support and very good helpful pattern which can push the price action up uh, above the EM at 10 and 20 back. Once we will see the price action will cross up the EMA 10 and 20 on two day chart, then it will be back on the bullish rally that was started in December. And this is the Ichimoku cloud. Even though we have seen that, the, that in, the, in the correction rally, the price action was showing a bearish trend, but here up to weekly chart, the, the, the cloud is turned bullish. Before that, in my previous chart, I've shown you that up to four day chart at that time, the cloud was turning bullish. This is a four day chart here. And now up to seven days chart, the, the cloud is turned bullish and the lagging span of the cloud has crossed up the price action. Now it is moving down, but still it is above the price action. And the, the price line has crossed up the baseline and the conversion line and the cloud as well. And at this time, the price action during this correction rally is retesting the baseline and the conversion line and the cloud as well. And once this retesting will be successful, then the price line can move up again and continue this bullish rally that is just recently started. But there is one uh, indicator I've placed on this chart that is very much important. If we just see that indicator, 
uh, the, the Ichimoku cloud with that indicator on for, for this chart, that will be, in, in my point of view, that will be good and appropriate. Because uh, this is the chop zone. It was very strong bullish, but it is now turned weak bullish from strong bullish. So once we should we should keep an eye on this indicator. One is uh, it will be turned again strong bullish like here. Then we can see that the price action will again move up, and this lagging span will be also mo moved up, and it it will also cross up the cloud as well. Because this is very very strong indicator on this weak chart. If it will be turned bearish, then we can see that the the Bitcoin Cash can continue the uh, the bearish trend. So uh, at this time, I'm hopeful that the Bitcoin Cash will be able to uh, cross up the EMA 10 and 20 for the continuation of the bullish trend or bullish rally. But unless it will not cross up these EMAs, it will be difficult for the Bitcoin Cash to continue the bullish rally. And we should keep an eye on this indicator. That is very much important on weekly chart. So this was the update by the Bitcoin Cash. Uh, if you have any opinion, any comments or suggestions, you can just drop me in the comments. And if you like the video, then do hit the like and do subscribe to the channel. Take care. Goodbye.